Hello children, welcome to today's English online class. Yes children, in this class let us see page number 42 that is story time from the lesson the sage and the mouse. Okay children, let us see this today. Look at each picture and describe what is happening in it. Then put them in the correct sequence, numbering them from 1 to 6. So here you can see some pictures. Right children? So these are not there in correct order. So we should put them in the correct sequence by numbering 1 to 6. Okay, let us see the picture one by one and let us see what is happening in this picture. So, you know this. So, this is the story of the lion and the mouse. Right children, let us see this one first picture. Here in this picture you can see the lion is very angry. Right children, and this mouse is squeaking. Squeak, squeak. Right children, next here. So, the lion is trapped in a hunter's net. Right. And next, here you can see the lion is very angry. Right. And this mouse is explaining something. Right. Is begging something. Next, in this picture, you can see the lion is sleeping. Here, the mouse is gnawing the net. Right. Next, here you can see they are smiling. Right children, like a friends, they are sitting here. So, let us write the numbers from 1 to 6. Let us put these pictures in correct sequence. Okay children. And the first will be this picture. Okay. So, here you can see a lion lay asleep in the forest. His great head resting on his paws. Right children. So, this is the first picture in the story. And the next, next picture, here you can see, this is second. Okay. So, the timid little mouse came upon him unexpectedly and in a fright and haste to get away, ran across the lion's nose, rose from his nap, and see here, this is third one, rose from his nap. The lion laid his huge paw angrily on the tiny creature to kill her. Okay, next it is telling, spare me, begged the poor mouse. Please let me go and someday I will surely repay you. Okay, next. The lion was astonished by the bravery of the mouse and he let the mouse free. Days passed and here once when the lion went for a hunt, he got trapped in a hunter's net and he is unable to free himself. He filled the forest with his angry roaring. So, this is fourth one. Okay. Angry roaring. Next year. The mouse knew the voice and quickly found the lion struggling in the net. Running to one of the great ropes that bound him. He gnawed it until it parted and soon the lion was free. So this is fifth one. And next they became good friends. This is sixth one. Okay children. So this is the story of the lion and the mouse. So this is first one, second, third. Fourth, fifth and sixth. Okay children, so this is the story of the lion and the mouse. What is the moral of this story children? What is the moral? The smallest act of kindness 
make the biggest difference in someone's life. Right children? Next, see here. Think of a good title for the story. What is a good title for the story? We can give the lion and the mouse. Right children? Title, we should write title. What is the title we can give? The lion and the mouse. Okay children? So this is the title of the story. Okay children? So see this one and write this in correct sequence numbering them from 1 to 6. This is about today's session children. Have a good day. Take care.